Welcome back, welcome back guys to another brand gaming craft and the reason why I say my, not my name like that because I changed my YouTube name it's now Brian's Gaming Craft you can still find me as my own YouTube name okay so let's get started so yes you can see we have Tekken and no we're not gonna I'm not gonna play Tekken right now I'm actually gonna show you guys um usually people have problems which I had the problem with um Tekken he said I'm um, running out of memory or running out of RAM or he usually says running out of memory okay so usually you should see um, your thing so okay so I'm gonna fix I'm gonna help you fix this problem right now okay before anything when you start up your tech ed, you go up here click options and you should see only these three things you shouldn't see this you only should see that and Tekken needs more than one gigabyte of RAM for it to run. And I'm gonna show you right now how to do it. Okay. Now, first of all, you need to get Java. Obviously, you need to get the offline Windows offline 30-bit or the 64-bit. And some people ask how you find out. I have Windows 8, by the way so it's kind of more complicated so you just um if you have Windows 8 just or Windows 10 it's pretty much the same thing just go open your folder right click on your it says your computer go to properties and the screens you pop out the screen and you can see right here it says um, 64 bit okay, you need that anymore so you download this and you install it easy as that now, when it's done installing, I'm not gonna install it because I already have it. Okay. So when it's done installing, oh, you exit. Hey, it's better to exit. Take it out. Forgot to tell you guys. So you all you're gonna do, it's if I correct. Uh, I don't. I don't know if I can actually get my thing to open here. You're gonna click Java. Am I correct? Okay, so you search Java. Um, you can search it on the run. I'm, I guess it will work. Java. No, it wouldn't work on the run. But you can search Java on your search thing. Uh, if you have Windows Seven, you should just open your window and search it up. Windows Eight, people have to search it up through here. Okay, so. Um. So yeah. So now you're gonna click here where it says Java. You're gonna click where it says View and once you start a program this thing should already pop out here you shouldn't have nothing here now i'm gonna tell you if you want to add more than one gigabyte um, okay so one gigabyte it's uh i think it's 24 if i'm correct so if you want to add eight gigabytes you do it times eight that's the amount of what you're gonna put here. But since oops, since I'm doing um, two, so I'm gonna do it times two. That's the amount I have right here. Okay, so you can do which how much depending on how much RAM you have. I wouldn't suggest if you have four gigabytes of RAM. I wouldn't suggest taking three. I would suggest to taking two, and it does the job really fine. So you're gonna. You're gonna um, double click here. You're gonna do type slash x m s two zero four eight, which is the code, or depending on how much RAM you're willing to add. And then you're gonna put m all together, and then you're gonna put OK, apply. That's it, done. You don't need this anymore. Now you're gonna go here and open your ticket. Okay, now you're gonna go to options, and you see, see if depending on much RAM your computer has, uh, if it has eight, you should see up to seven gigabytes. But mine says has four, it's only three. But I put two because I don't want to use all of it. And since I'm always recording, my I can actually play fine, and it won't tell me that. And 
I I actually do like it. So I will leave the link to this thing on the description. That way you guys don't have problems. And if it liked you, make sure you hit that like button and make sure you subscribe for more things to help out. See you next time, guys, and peace out.